Hello again with a new video. Today we have a locked Samsung S8 with the factory reset protection. It's running Android 7, which means it's going to be a little bit harder to open. But if you follow these steps, you will be fine. As you can see, it's locked with a Google account. So start by turning off the phone by holding the power button when it's completely off hold power button volume down and Bixby button all together to enter the download mode it should boot to the green screen with the phone details now plug the phone to the computer and switch to the PC now open Odin and make sure the phone is detected in the AP field choose the combination file as always I will put the download links for all the files that I'm going to use in the description now when Odin is done verifying the file press star and wait for it be careful, this combination is for the G950F model. If you have other model, search in the Google for the combination file specific for that model. If you see the past message, the phone will reboot in a custom Android version. Now, from the top, press the dotted square and open the settings. Scroll down to the developer options. Make sure USB debugging is on and look for OEM unlocking. Don't worry, if you can't find it, just skip this step, but if you do find it you have to enable it now shut down the phone and re-enter the download mode again then switch to the PC Now we are going to install the stock firmware of the phone. The link to download it will be in the description as well. In Odin, in the BL field, choose the file that starts with the BL. In the AP, put the file that starts with the AP. I usually put it last because it takes longer to verify. And uh, here I made a mistake. Instead of loading the CSC file, I loaded the CP file. And uh, you will see why. It got wet till uh, the end, then it failed. as you can see uh, that's why I had to uncheck the CP and load the CSC file with the file that start with home CSC not the file that start with CSC then press start
this time it will take uh, a way longer than the first time so I'm going to speed it up after that the phone will reboot a couple of times then boot to the setup wizard Wait for a few seconds until it loads up completely. Don't be impatient like I did. After you complete the setup, you will land on the home screen but it's not done yet as you can see the phone is in french because the firmware that we installed was in french so i have to change the language here just doing some checkups The count tab is empty, good. And the, the security patch, it's April 1st, 2017. We are almost done. We just need to enable developer mode by tapping the build number seven times. Now go back twice and enter the developer option. From there, enable the OEM unlock and uh, finally factory set the phone. Now the phone will reboot and it is all the previous data and start fresh. After the first boot, you will need to complete the usual shoot-up instructions. And that's it. Now the lock is permanently removed. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave your feedback and see you in the next tutorial.